But you must get that. When, I mean, when you're walking around here, do people come up and say, what are you doing here? Why you should be, you should be down there? Uh, like 50% of the time. The other yeah. 50% of the time, people, because it's just so much part of your life, yeah. that they just figure that they know you. Indeed. Um, and they can't actually quite work out where from. You know, like, do you work at the supermarket just down the road or something <laughs> like that? Your face seems really familiar. You've got really... I've yeah. seen you before. <laughs> I suppose it's quite a shock to see you walking around in, in London. Has this been uh, a, a tiny... Have you had some time here in the UK or is it just a small trip? Actually, yeah, yesterday, well, just, it's a, it's a small trip. So yesterday was my day off and I went and saw the Tower of London, which is lovely. Excellent. Yeah, I was walking around through London, listening to Adele. It was great fun. Oh, <laughs> brilliant. Had a great time. That's like being in your own, <laughs> being in your own pop video, yeah, really. Yeah, was brilliant. And of course, you were over here to do Celebrity Big Brother. Yes, I was, yeah. 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 Now, for goodness sake, is, was that, I mean, what was that experience like? Because it's got very dark now. I think, yeah. you, got, I think you did it at the right time. Oh, really? Years ago. Yeah. yeah, it was, it well, you had some lovely people in there. Mm. Um, I don't know, it's an interesting, it's an interesting thing because shortly into it, I, um, I was watching, I watched um, some, some footage that they had shot and edited in a particular way and I'd realised that I couldn't actually be myself in there because... Um, you can, they can edit it however they want. Exactly. Um, so, and, exactly. and the fact that I've got to protect the, the neighbour's brand and all that kind of stuff. So, um, I found that I wasn't being able to be myself mm. uh, in there. But, um, you know, in terms of an experience, it was a crazy experience. <laughs> it was a one in a lifetime experience. Maybe not do it again. <laughs> Oh, I'll give it another shot. No, why not? Why not? Why not? Yeah. I think it's good that you're open to all these kind of things. But you're right. Everybody gets assigned a role and then it is edited to, to that. Yeah, Oftentimes. That's it. Oftentimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you have no control over it at all. Yeah. No but let's all. talk about happy no, times. No, let me say happy times. Or, no, what's or, this or maybe not so happy times. What's this? Um, you gotta, you got to choose a team, all right? So we've got Team, team Sonia. Team Sonia? Okay. Yeah. I Come do on. like Sonia. Yeah, the, the, you know, the love of his life. I do like and daughter. Sonia. But then there's the first love of the life, Team D. No, do you know you... what? I'm going to go Team Sonia for yeah. a while. I'll tell you for why. I don't know where she's been and, and oh. I don't know what she's got up to. Ah. I know where Sonia's been and she's lovely. What happens if we find out that, you know, like she, she had amnesia and she was deserted on an island and she's been doing it hard and, you know, nearly died? Can and... I be both of them? You can be both of them. You can have both of them. And then throughout love. the storyline, if you feel like you can change, go Thank for you. it. I will. Yours. I will. I will see you. It's on Channel 5, 1.45 and half past five every weekday. Yes. Thank you. No worries. Great Thanks for having me. Thank you, love.